Well, I got my Anderson Construction Southern Plains water truck in today. It's, it's a pretty nice one. Jeff didn't tell me it didn't hold water. Huh. Just a little hole. Now look what we can do. So, Eric and me went and got my new water truck today. Um, the <clears throat> the ad on the auction said it had a DT-466 that ran when parked. And I'm not sure if you can recognize it, but that might not be a DT-466. Anyway, um, we're trying to get it primed up. We're going to see if we can get it running. Eric thinks it'll run. Um, that, did you say no? Oh, I don't know. Oh, it's okay. It's going to get fuel to it. Oh, uh, we gotta get fuel to it. The primer don't seem to be working. Anyway, big V8. I think. What'd you say? The five. I think it's a 549. 549. It's a nine liter international V8 engine. Got an inline Bosch um, injector pump. I think a five speed, two speed rear end. It's an international 1700 82 model. Anyway, auction. Uh, price was 538 or no 638 I think I paid six I paid 658 I think for it. total anyway I got a hell of a deal for a, a truck with the wrong engine in it so this is the interior of the truck uh, the back wind has been out of it for a while seats look decent these little stitching um, don't have no key switch so we're gonna have to figure out which wire does what. Um, this pump doesn't need power to run, so it's one of them deals where you could jump it. It would probably run. It's got a, kill, a manual kill switch, so shouldn't be a big deal if it does start up. We should be able to turn it off, hopefully. Yeah. I smell smoke. Put my foot through the floorboard? No. Is that what you said? Yeah. The mouse get, might get mad at me. All right, go. Well, the duct tape's leaking. 
Actually, the tank needs, needs a new tank. That's just pretty crazy. What are you doing? cylinder they got a two-way air valve on there how about that now all we need is a tank fixed and well the only problem we got now is the water tank has a few holes in it I'll show you how they had this set up it's got a six inch pipe coming out the bottom of the tank what they had is a hydraulic cylinder here that ran a, a gate valve or a, a butterfly valve and a little spray bar. So you can see there's just it's just full of rust. But the water come out it through this crack and hit this plate sprayed out the back. I actually saw this truck run one time. It's been a long time ago. Uh, the guy that owned it used to do a lot of the dirt work on the pads I dug footings on. Anyway, I need to get the right battery in it. But I, I'm just tickled that it runs. Um, but I, I'm not sure if the tank's going to be worth repairing. It's got some really bad spots in it. But a little bit of plate, a little bit of welding. We might be able to patch it up, don't know. You ready to start welding on the tank? 